Hello, you're welcome to this tutorial video where I'll be showing you how to make use of banner design feature on Brainbacks. That is, you now have the opportunity to design your own banner yourself without having to download the banner somewhere else. So, what you have to do, you come to the sidebar here and you click on banner design. And then the banner design page will be opened up for you this way. So then you have all the features here that you can make use of, right? And now the very first thing you have to do before you begin to create your banner design is to make sure you confirm the size, right? The size of the banner you have to design for your brain box account, right? Now to confirm the size, you have to check your monetize board here. And here, upload both banner 728 by 90. Now, so the size you're making use of is 728 by 90. So now we have to go back to our banner design page to continue. Now here, you have to click on create new. Then you set it to 728 by 90. You click on create. And you're gonna have the banner size displayed like this, right? So now, after that, you have to, you may decide to change the background color, you know, this way, like this, right? And you click on apply, right? So you can also make use of shapes here, right? You have the rectangle, triangle, arrow, you know, you got different shapes. Now let's make use of the rectangle and drive it, drive it to the side. Then you have to, you may decide to change the color, apply. Then you're gonna have the color here. You can change to your choice. Okay, sorry. You click on it first. Then you click on the color, right? Depending on what you want. Is now depends on your choice. So now let me make this a red, then click on apply. Right, so now for you to ensure that this color does not change or does not get to affect your design, you have to click on this match. Right, that is to match this shape with the background that we already had. Right, so now you click on match, and as you can see, we cannot change these background anymore so i have decided that i'm gonna make use of this particular uh, background for my design so now moving on you have to create write some text you know so now this is the interface now you have to add text add text double click to edit you double click You click on it and you drag it, change the color, say why, right? Make money and lie. You can adjust this size here and take it back like that. You know, adjust it, you adjust it, right? So you can leave it like that, or you may still decide. So, okay, you click on apply. I'm gonna apply the color, right? You can check the texture. You see, you see, you see. Once you click on it, you should change the text like that. But I'm not making use of any of these. Now you click on cancel. If you click on the text again, you should bring them out. You check outline. Can adjust it and you know it will change the text automatically you click on it you have to click on you know the color then you adjust and of course you can click if i click on green you know if you change it blue orange you know like that i click on white if you change it again and you know just to adjust the text so 
drag it just to make sure that it suits your taste and that's it so now you click on apply and uh, you add another text depending on what you want or how you want your design to be so double click And up to um, I say um, drag it up. You have to adjust the size this way, then to change the arrangement of the text you can, uh, you can click on apply here okay before then let's look at the color again i want to change it to white right or change it to black something like that you know okay or these yes i can manage these so let me look for my black again yeah that's okay so you click on apply and you click on the text again you look at text style text style then you do this right you adjust it a little bit yeah so if you still want to you know add anything to it maybe underline it right uh do it like this but let me remove it you click on apply again then you may decide to change the fonts Something like this, a bit, something like this, you know. But I think the fonts, okay, let me check this, right. So, you can adjust it like that. So now you click on apply. Okay, good. So, um i want to okay you can make it of stickers as well i mean, click on emotions to bring out different emotions for you and if you don't need it to close you close you go back so now corners corners you can adjust the corners click on apply and as you can see as adjusted it now as well we can add pictures to our design and how do you do that you come here you can see open here you click on it you look at overlay image you click on overlay image here so you pick the image you want to make it of and it's here already you adjust to your taste can adjust to your taste adjust it yeah let me bring it back like this you know so so I want to add another text to this page you know just to make it uh, like a call to action i want to add my call to action now so i can decide to make it of shapes we look at uh let me make it of this arrow here okay so you have to rotate the arrow i want to rotate the arrow now you adjust it adjust 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 then i want to make sure that i reduce the size of my arrow right but i leave it that way then i want to write something now you click on apply great so having done that i want to write something you have to close this then you click on text here add text then you may decide to change the color here before you even write then then you 
we want to reduce the size and you drag it here I drag it here then you know you click on apply and just like I said the other time you can change the text style here once you put it in center right then after doing that I want to make sure you click on apply here and after that you can still do something make some changes I want to change the color right I think this is okay this is perfect okay, you click on apply and or you want to flip duplicate if you want to duplicate you duplicate this way and you put it here or you want to delete it again you delete and these after adjusting it maybe you still want to duplicate these you can duplicate it a bit sooner go on here adjust these You know, like that so you can flip it right you can flip it like that and you can delete it so let me flip this let me flip this right I think I like this now let me increase the size So this is how to make your own banner. You are not limited at all. You can go ahead and just design your banner anyhow you want it. All the tools are here for you already. So you can just go ahead and design your banner. Meanwhile, after creating all of these, you have to ensure that you still make use of this merge to ensure that your design is not scattered and all of that. You have to merge it, click on merge, and it's merged already. Now for you to download these, you have to right click on the image, then you click on save image. And of course it should download to your computer, just like this, you know, you can change the name, image, uh, and you save. So that is it on how to design your banner for your Blinkbox account. Thank you very much.